how much screen time is too much screen time. Okay, a popular one given the current state of the world also. So know that everything that I say is based off of research and development and not meant to um, parent guilt in any way because I know that special circumstances exist in, in today's world. But um, the American Academy of Pediatrics says anything up until eight months, 18, I'm sorry, 18 months of age, we should not be having screen time. It really not just limits verbal output, meaning if a child is interacting or I'm sorry, passively watching TV, they don't get the, the opportunity to communicate or practice their communication skills with you. All of those necessary pre-verbal skills we talked about um, are just diminished when they're watching TV. So even things like attention, which again is not just the gateway to communication, it's the gateway to learning, is really negatively impacted by screen time. So even between the years of two and five, they recommend only limiting screen time, which includes phones, which includes tablets, which includes laptops, everything, to only one hour. And I would say even when you're using that one hour, you should focus on a couple of things. You should focus on keeping it minimal. You should be watching and being mindful of the time, making sure you don't go over an hour. You should also be creating opportunities for interaction during those shows or during YouTube videos, whatever you're utilizing, because those are things I utilize in therapy. If we have a song, like a repetitive nursery rhyme, maybe after the first three, you can pause the video and say, what's he gonna say? And see if the child remembers from the previous ones. And that way you're making it more of a collaborative interactive activity as opposed to one of those passive activities just watching TV. And you can also do your best to try and avoid academic-based programming. Academics are extremely <laughs> important, but really those children are going to get those academics in school. So what I like to focus on with my recommendations for screen time are things that describe abstract concepts to kids um, and social skills because social skills are very particular depending on the situation. So if you can find episodes about kindness, about resiliency for your child, not only are you building their communication, but you're building their overall well-being and development as a person because you're giving and introducing those abstract concepts in a way that is palatable to them and a, from a very young age and that they can take with them as they develop? Yeah, that's a tricky question. 